Time out. It's KLC Throw the Spirit Coach. Getting you in shape and form for the age of Aquarius yet again. Um, let's talk. What y'all think? I'm just trying to get everybody an opinion. See what everybody... Uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm talking about this situation, y'all. What's good? What's good? Yeah, because motherfuckers... Y'all motherfuckers don't know how to talk. Y'all motherfuckers don't know how to have an opinion. You know what I'm saying? Y'all motherfuckers don't have no opinion on shit. That's the thing. That's the thing. It's like... Motherfuckers gotta start having an opinion on shit. Like we the we the people, we the community. So we gotta start having an opinion on shit. Like you know what I'm saying. Everybody getting on the internet, doing what we doing. You know what I'm saying. Talking astrology and shit like that. Y'all done seen Kanye in the interview talk about astrology. You know what I'm saying with the two Libras and shit like that. So we changing the world. So we changing interaction and we changing culture and how and what we what we we changing the subject matter and shit like that. And astrology is an important one. And I ain't gonna let y'all take that one and shit like that. I was sent here by the gods to pour that. As a motherfucking wine of God and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I'm tell see the spirit coach. Get you a shape and form for the age of Aquarius and shit like that. Because you know what I'm saying? We got to understand the real aspect of these things. When we looking at them just so it ain't no cool message that we could just use and, and dry up. And, and you know what I'm saying? Drink dry and, and, and motherfucking, you know, kick to the curb. That ain't what's happening. That ain't what's happening. You know what I'm saying? I ain't putting none of these things in nobody's face like that. This is something that. Everybody got to worship, but this is something that we all doing, whether you like it or not. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you know what I'm saying? We always go through a water cycle with our body. We all got certain times of the day, certain times of the motherfucking seasons. You know what I'm saying? That's all astrology. <coughs> What's positioning, where it's at, based on relative to where we at. You know what I'm saying? So right now, for instance, we in motherfucking Libra season. <clears throat> so Libra season is when the sun, you know what I'm saying? First, it starts in Aries season. It starts in Aries season. The sun starts in Aries season as far as what we correlate as spring. You know what I'm saying? The sun starts in Aries season as far as what we correlate as spring. So, you know what I'm saying? We motherfucking get spring, which is the Gemini through Taurus. We get summer, which is Cancer through motherfucking Virgo. And then we get fall. So that's when the sun starts to fall away. Or that big body of influence that we call in the sun starts to get further away and things of that nature. And that's when the sun separates from our body of water that we own. And it causes less friction. So it's not as much heat. You know what I'm saying? It's not as much it's not as much uh, heat. It's not as much light. You know what I'm saying? It's not as much uh, transformation going on. You know what I'm saying? And that's what we call fall because the sun is starting to fall away and go into the areas be be beneath the horizon. So this say if this was the horizon straight across. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's how we got to look at it. So we do that. We, we do that on macro and micro scales throughout the day with time and developing, you know what I'm saying, our own little 360 based on... The sun being it going through certain aspects of the sky, we would call those, you know what I'm saying, um, you, you have the sun rising, you know what I'm saying, so this would be like a micro version of spring, the highest point of of the day, 12 p.m., that would be cancer, which is the uh, the, uh, the, 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 mac, the micro version of fucking summer, and then, you know what I'm saying, when the sun fall away, when it go into the nighttime, that's when we get the micro version of fall, and, to go, and then they go into the death aka beneath the horizon and shit like that and you know what i'm saying that's how we correlate this shit but it's a micro and macro experience astrology is so you know what i'm saying so you once you understand that you start to understand the transitions of it and then you're understanding you know what i'm saying what the fuck is going on far as you know why we call these certain influences in times of days and seasons and correlated and gave them titles and names now these energies exist on their own without us giving them titles and shit like that. So everybody can, you know what I'm saying, for the most part, you know what I'm saying, tap in and feel what the fuck we talking about. Because, you know, these motherfucking influences are a thing of their own. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Shout out to everybody in the chat. But, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, for the most part, you know, that's how we discover astrology. You know what I'm saying? We discover astrology by going through it. And then once we go through something, then you can gain some type of awareness and then place names and titles and shit like that on specific 
time periods, time of the days and shit like that, seasons and whatever. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we still in Libra season right now. But everybody's starting to feel the transition of, of us going to Scorpio season where we're going to be the main the main thing that we're going to be paying attention to is passion, motivation, desire. And that's going to be in the eighth house, you know what I'm saying, based on, you know, what's deep to us, that fixated water sign being fixated on our own emotions and feelings and things of that nature. And that causes uh, that causes like deep transformation, you know what I'm saying, um, deep motivation and shit like that. So everybody's starting to feel deeply motivated. Everybody going to want to take power control over now, who created, ever created these energies matter, matters none. They created, motherfucker. These are basically how we, the, the transitions of a mind. You know what I'm saying? We all got, you know what I'm saying, created our chakra system like this. So, you know what I'm saying? Your ass get horny too. You know what I'm saying? Your ass go to your eighth house and look at your desires too. You know what I'm saying? So, you can't run away from it. Astrology is the is the body. You know what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's everything. So, you know what I'm saying? For the most part. That's how we that's how we mapping out shit. You feel me? Yeah, we appreciate you too, bro. We appreciate you too. But uh, you know, um, so when we talking about what is the title and shit, let me see, I gotta see the title. Uh we was talking about Jewish. Okay, yeah, so Jewish shout out to the Jews, you know what I'm saying? Because they motherfucking, you know what I'm saying? You know how they did, they did, they did what they did, they did what they did. When things of that nature, they created, you know, the, what we call the Bible. And language and created a language out of a, a you know a sign you know signs and sigils and things of that nature but what i don't want to see right now is just because i'm spiritually inclined like you know what i'm saying i don't want to see it so i gotta say what i don't want to see you know what i'm saying because i'm like the water bearer in real flesh i'm like you know what i'm saying i'm like zeus in real flesh so what i don't want to see right now is black people starting to try to you know what i'm saying they trap y'all in a narrative of like pointing at the jews as motherfucking you know what i'm saying um Pointing at the Jews as as as, as something um, to be like fighting against or some shit like that because that's what we don't that's we don't need that we don't need that you should not be fighting you know what I'm saying for real because like the, the and it's not even the aspect of you shouldn't be understanding you know of what's going on but it ain't even in that spectrum it's more so you should be understanding of. Um, um, when we talk about Jewish in the context of what, you know, um, before it, it became a race of people and things of that nature, you know what I'm saying? And what they was calling Jews back in, in text days in the Bible, they were pointing to a specific group of people that um, had a certain practice. And that's why any Jew that is into the uh, uh, understanding of what Jewish came from and what Jewish etymology you know what I'm saying, means, and it tracks back to the tribe of Judea, which is the Leo tribe, and really it just means to thank, and shit like that, so you, can, so regardless of what skin color, what race they were, how they looked back in the days, who was the first black, it was an energy signature that, that they was in that we all have access to, and that is, you know what I'm saying, anytime we're in the aspect of being thankful, or being thankful, or appreciative, or, sh or having uh, a certain, um, a vision to kind of separate us to be from being to, um, to put us in a position of where we didn't have to be thankful for this is what they're calling that you know what I'm saying this is what they're calling these types of people and shit like that and so once you get that understanding of why they move the way they do why they think the way they do you know what I'm saying now far as how they made that look is what they gave y'all they gave y'all motherfucking um um the um um, what to, what to be thankful about, you know what I'm saying? So what to be thankful about? Their money, their businesses, their entertainment, their religion, and their politics. Now, if you ain't doing something in accordance with one of those five systems and something like that and shit like that, this is when you not doing business right, aka, you know what I'm saying? You ain't going to get there for one sums and this shit like that, and you ain't following that. You dumb. If you ain't doing that entertainment right, you ain't becoming a rapper, a puppet, and agreeing and upholding their laws and their systems and things of that nature or their politics while you're entertained. You ain't in the book. You kind of you stupid. You ain't getting no money and shit like that. If you ain't did their education system, you ain't went to go get no PhD. You ain't went to get no college degree. You ain't went to get no none like that. You know what I'm saying? This is when you dumb in that education system. And if you ain't 
um, I did business, entertainment, religion. No, um, business, entertainment, now politics. If you ain't voting and shit like that, and while we while we blatantly see that don't work and that don't change, you ain't getting none of that. You ain't getting none of that benefits as far as even just the people and the thoughts agreeing around you that that's like the right thing to do. So you ain't getting none of that. You know what I'm saying? And then if you ain't doing the motherfucking, um, the last one right, um, I said uh, business, education, religion. So, you know what I'm saying? If you ain't praising their God and things of that nature, or if you got your own version of God and things of that nature, be ready to deal with all the demonic spirits in the world that think that that's not the right thing to do and shit like that. And they, you know what I'm saying? And, and yeah, be ready. So that's the, so so that so that's what so that's the basic thing now. As far as like the actual concept of uh, that word in general, Jewish or whatever, you know what I'm saying? It's not a, it's not a bad thing. You know what I'm saying? It's more so just a state of being or idea or a certain intellect. That's why they like they said they'll tell you that it means to think and to be thankful. To be thankful, you have to receive a certain idea to be thankful about. So that's a certain intellect and shit like that. Because only a certain, if you not don't have no idea about yourself, you're not gonna get up and be able to maneuver through the world. You know what I'm saying? Now, what was their idea? Whatever they created in the Bible, their God, the way they deal with their virtues and principles, the way that they manifest and shit like that. And they practice those rituals and spells. Now, now as far as what they created as a race and gave them more of the benefits of that you know what I'm saying? Of what they want y'all to be think, thankful of. Because you can have some people that is 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 that, but they still like sheep in a way. You know what I'm saying? Because they may have, they may receive the benefits, the money, cars, clothes, and things, but they don't really even know that they re rock to sleep to some certain extent. So that's another thing. Okay? So now, getting on to Kanye, like, I like how what Kanye is doing, you know what I'm saying? Um, and I think, for the most part, um, you know, it is it is fighting for a specific uh, position and things of that nature. And the, the position is really just to fight for your own spirituality. Now, the thing is, you know what I'm saying, it's good to fight for your own spirituality and things of that nature. But you got to make it make sense, though. You know what I'm saying? You got to make it make sense. Because God wants you to take people out of things that aren't spiritual in a specific way. You know what I'm saying? And so when you give people, when you rid people's pressures and things of that nature and their, their ability to stress and you give them something that is more beneficial or you should be example to something that is more beneficial to that experience and you let God work through you. You know what I'm saying? This is when, you know what I'm saying, you can bring something totally new here. And I'm not talking about God in the context of what what it was taught in the five pillars of um, the shadow government, which is, like I just said, in religion, if you're not praising their God or if you have your own concept of spirituality and things of that nature, which everybody got to be careful because a lot of y'all ain't, resp ain't responsible enough to have your own concept of spirituality. This is when we get people in jail. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know, people in jail that look just like us because, yeah, they had you know, they were free in a sense, but, you know, they didn't really have no, they needed somebody else to even tell them what that spiritual system should look like in a certain way. You know what I'm saying? Like, and then that kind of boggles your mind as far as like, if I tell you don't, um, you know what I'm saying? If I tell you don't kill somebody or something like that, you should already know that. But just because you being told that, you know what I'm saying? You're going to be like, you're going to be like, why this person telling me this? And it's just kind of like a mind fuck at that point. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like, motherfuckers got to uh, just wisen up a little bit. But yeah, I'll fuck what Kanye is doing and shit like that. But I agree with Dolo when he said like the Nori shit. Like he shouldn't have did that. Like he shouldn't have let Nori, you know what I'm saying? He shouldn't have let Nori do him like that. Well, he couldn't stop it, but Dory should have Dory did it like that, though. Real shit. We beat up Dory. We had beat up Dory for that. Like, why you do that, bro? Like, like, you know what I'm saying? Bro tweak it, but bro trying to, bro the plug. Like, you know what I'm saying? But this is just, you not woke enough. You ain't, you ain't see, you know what I'm saying? And things of that nature, you know what I'm saying? But, um, but for the most part, you know, um, yeah. So this is when we in an aspect, 
any, you know what I'm saying, and, and we're getting free, you know what I'm saying, we're kind of waking up a little bit, you know what I'm saying, and we're, we're pretty much kind of taking our power back in a way, you know what I'm saying, and on an individual level, now, if you ain't doing this in your own life, then you ain't shit, you know what I'm saying, it ain't about just watching people all day and things of that nature, you know what I'm saying, that man fighting his own fight, you should be fighting your own fight in your world too, because if you just complacent with everything, then you ain't shit, you know what I'm saying? That's what it. That's where, that's what, um, you 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 kind of program to be complacent with. And I ain't really, you know what I'm saying? We ain't really with that. You know what I'm saying? We don't come with no program. Now the spirit. And if you want to talk spirituality, the spirit ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? The spirit ain't none of these titles and names that y'all be trying to give it, and things of that nature and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, so we actually, you know, we changing the world a little bit. You know, we got uh. You know, we got a conversation going on. And it is sad that, you know what I'm saying, ain't nobody talking about it for real. You know what I'm saying? But me and this bitch, as far as in my area and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? I don't know nobody talking like this. You know what I'm saying? I ain't seen nobody I ain't seen nobody making music like me. I ain't seen nobody doing business like me. I ain't seen nobody talking like me. You know what I'm saying? It's in my area, at least. You know what I'm saying? So if y'all let, where y'all let? Shit, we need to bend up, link together and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Get this shit going and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Now... That's the shit, you know what I'm saying? Now, that's the shit behind closed doors that need to be talked about as far as, like, what they're actually doing to actually, you know, man, motherfucking manifest reality. They manifest them a position. That's what you need to actually be informed. How are they doing this shit? You know what I'm saying? Like, this, you you think you could just go to a Bible and screen their God and things of that nature and be like, and be like, um, you think that that's going to work for you? You ain't make that up. You know what I'm saying? So you got to understand the starting point a little bit. The starting point is with you and shit like that. And whatever you make up and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? And you can't be jealous. You can't be jealous. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to really want to be jealous of nobody. You know what I'm saying? Why are you jealous and shit like that? You know what I'm saying? You can't be jealous, blood. You can't be jealous. You can't be jealous. Hey, this remind me of Facebook when um I, I first get on Facebook and I, uh, I was, I was at the school, right? I was at, I was at Thornwood High School, and I, and I would come home and do like after school videos and just be on some rap shit, whatever, just be spitting and shit. And then like no, nobody was watching it. And then like after everybody would watch it and something like that. So it's cool, it's cool. I fuck with it. But yeah, um, yeah. So you know, motherfuckers gotta get their mind. Motherfuckers gotta start taking their power back. Period. 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 And shit like that. And fuck Kanye. I've been saying this shit by myself. You know what I'm saying? In my own space. In my own space. You know what I'm saying? So motherfuckers gotta pop out. You know? Get shit some get some shit put together and shit like that. And what you need is that you need motherfucking um you need the motherfucking association. You need a teamwork. You need a teamwork makes the dream work. You know what I'm saying? You need to make yourself a part of something that's going on. You need to put your your opinion on in on shit. You need to, you know what I'm saying? So we can get this mind regulated and going and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? This this shit rotating and shit like that. Because ain't no way. Ain't no way. You know what I'm saying? Unless y'all just t tired of being subpar. You're tired of being subpar. And that's, you know, fuck y'all. Fuck y'all. You know what I'm saying? I look at these motherfuckers. Come on. You know what I'm saying? Fuck y'all. Real shit. Shout out to everybody in the chat. It's me in spirit right now. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. But you know, like we changing culture. Like I said, you know what I'm saying? Y'all seen Kanye on the drink chat with talking about two Libras and shit like that. That means we on the frequency, bitch. You should get on the frequency too. Motherfucker. Learn your motherfucking astrology so shit can be a little bit easy. You know what I'm saying? Now, I ain't, look, now, you can not learn it if you want to. That would be up on you at that point. You know what I'm saying? Learn your astrology, bitch. I give you a key. Go to uh, YouTube and put in D-O-E-L-O-W. Put your zodiac sign. And broski gonna get you right. Shit, broski gonna get you right. You feel me? Yeah, but and that's bro. Shout out to bro. That's bro. Real shit. That's bro. That's that's bro. That's the soul family. You know what I'm saying? 
But yeah, so once you get out of this aspect of shit, we got, you know what I'm saying? Y'all can stop. Even the Chicago community, trash right now, trash, trash. Y'all ain't doing nothing new, trash, trash. All the rappers in it, trash. All the rappers in it, trash. All the people in it. If you ain't trying to do something new, if you ain't associated with Cito in some way, shape, or form, trash. If you ain't included Cito, trash. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I, I've been here in these streets for a long time since Kid with Raps. I ain't never changed. Nigga, I've been ta talking this shit that we was going to do something different. I've been telling y'all, you know what I'm saying, who had Boy Meets World. You know what I'm saying? Then who hit Kid Rap? I've been telling y'all, fuck that shit now. We didn't broke it once. It's time to break it again. And shit like that. And then we the new people. We the new, we the new, we look gonna look good while doing it. We gonna be on stage, our own stages that we creating while doing it. You know what I'm saying? Now, I didn't create my own stage. Ain't nobody responsible for my stage. Ain't nobody responsible for my fam. Ain't nobody responsible for my motherfucking, you know what I'm saying? But me and the people that I tag along with that. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to everybody that's, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know who y'all are. But, um, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So motherfuckers, shit. And things of that nature and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? We elevating culture. It's, it's over with. It's over with. It's over with. We elevating culture. It's a new, it's a new day. It's a new world. It's a new world. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, every, it's starting about to look like what I'm doing now. It's about to start looking like the hot shit. So get on board. If I got hella content, hella strategy, hella shout outs. Y'all know the people I be with. And shit like that. Get into their shit. You know what I'm saying? Mix and mingle and learn yourself a little bit more. And shit like that. And I ain't never going to be in no cap. I'm the plug. Really, I'm the plug. Okay? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You dealing with Zeus. Now, I came down here to Earth. You know what I'm saying? To motherfucking make it a little bit easier for y'all motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't got to be in at least the mental shit now. You know what I'm saying? Because that's where it starts. It starts with the mind. So if you don't start with the mind, then what is you doing? You know what I'm saying? You're going to be in the flesh. And the, in the, in the, in the flesh manifests after the mind. That's why they say get your mind right first. You know what I'm saying? So if you in a motherfucking environment in the hood... It ain't really about the people, places, and things around you. And shit like that is where you give your attention to. Your thought, that would be your masculine energy. Your idea. How you see yourself. Or just an intellect about how you go about your shit. And the way you want to externalize whatever you feminine feel. And shit like that. And we all have this ability. Some people do it on scales that's macro some people do it on scales that's micro but when you don't do that for yourself and shit like that and you don't have your own thought and feeling you just going with general consistency in some way shape or form this is you practicing a ritual and spell of whatever you want to be practiced on so why are you not saying your opinion amongst people that look like you and being um, being totally open and honest with that, because it's, it only it only go to a couple stances. It may go to one, but it's mainly because you already live in with whatever they didn't create it for you, and what they created for you is a certain already blockage. You know what I'm saying? So you already censoring your own mouth. You didn't put tape over your own mouth. That this is what y'all doing in the spiritual realm, you know what I'm saying? And this is what y'all doing. And when you do something there first, that only manifests the physical. So that's why the spirit ain't the body. You know what I'm saying? We create mentalities, and mentalities come through the um, come through our vessel, and we use our vessel, one, two, and third dimension as a ritual and spell to play out whatever we're um, we're visualizing or we're feeling. And so the better you get those correlated, the better you know your strategy, the better you know yourself and shit like that. And we got the best membership club out here for that. You know what I'm saying? CitoWorld.com slash membership where you can actually just have a relationship with basic one-on-one -on -one people 
and then just start to build get your building block straight and shit like that so you can get correlated and understand and i give you a, a monthly coach call and shit like that and um you know what i'm saying we gonna build a relationship like that you know what i'm saying so make sure y'all sign up for that and shit um but nonetheless you know we about to go into scorpio season so like i said everybody gonna be in some type of passion it's a lot of air in the sky right now so make sure you are affirming you know what i'm saying make sure you're talking your shit and too much sometimes too much talking could be negative you know i mean too much sometimes too much access to anything could be negative so even like if you have access to a bunch of um what up jim if you have a bunch of access to a bunch of um um thoughts and shit like that but you don't know not what to do with those thoughts and shit like that so anytime we got a grand trine in the sky that's a gift so we got a grand trine between three air signs right now we got a grand trine between gemini we got a grand trine between libra and we got a grand trine between um motherfucking um aquarius now what does this mean this means like planets are in each of those signs so if mars now what mars represent mars represents our passion our motivation our desire and our intention. So we all feel motivated, especially to speak in some way, shape, or form, or think. You know what I'm saying? Now, that's also going to give a gift access to what the Libra, Libra energy right now, because there's the Sun is in Libra, Venus is in Libra, and Mercury is in Libra. So not only we're going to want to be passionate and show us and start communicating in some way, shape, or form, we're going to want to be actionary. Whatever what's on our mind, we're going to want to act on that. We're going to want to relate that. And we're going to want to motherfucking communicate about that. And then, you know, we also have Saturn and Aquarius, which is going to bring a sense of gaining structure. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to want to gain structure based on our idea. You know what I'm saying? And um, our idea of ourselves. And, um, and so that's a free energy going around right now. So you can, right now you can kind of speak whatever you want to in, into existence and shit like that. But, you know, it's a gift. So, you know, you want to make sure that it's dealing with all the planets that's in it. So if it's some, so if it's Saturn and Aquarius, you want to make sure that you're, um, uh, that you're, um, um, trying, trying to gain a certain position, you know what I'm saying? Especially amongst the environment or the public. And then how you want to make that want to look is what the sun is that relatable, you want to motherfucking be relatable and then you want to communicate and then you want to add a little bit of passion. That's how you can speak something into existence right now. Just on some magic shit. Just on some, you know what I'm saying? On some spiritual shit. Like I'm giving y'all shit that Indians was doing and I'm giving y'all shit that these Jews was doing. So motherfuckers can start breaking down what the fuck is actually going on. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm saying. It ain't about being jealous. It's about just understanding what they understand. And then once you understand what they understand, you know what I'm saying? You can do that amongst yourself and be with your crew. You know what I'm saying? Be with your soul group. And then y'all can be the best shit in the world. So it ain't necessarily like you need them in some way, shape, or form. So Kanye kind of playing a little bit. You know what I'm saying? He kind of playing a little bit, but he's playing the game and things of that nature, and he's doing the fight his way, and shit like that, but, you know, as far as that, other than that, you know what I'm saying, he need to keep, put Kelsito on, um, on, um, on Keep My Spirit Alive, um, part, um, remix, and shit like that, you know what I'm saying, and tap in with us, and do a conversation and shit, what up, Mari, what up, my boy, you know what I'm saying, that's a powerful ass Leo, Leo King right there, you know what I'm saying, Mari, you know what I'm saying, that boy a real lad, real lion in this bitch, you know what I'm saying, Jen, what's your motherfucking, um, what's your sun moon, I never knew, um, but yeah, other than that, you know what I'm saying, shit, everything, everything is kosher, everything is kosher today, you know what I'm saying, God want to use us out here, you know what I'm saying, God want to use us, and he want to see our, you know what I'm saying, our imagination. Oh, shout out to you, Virgo. You a Virgo. So we just left Virgo season. So happy belated Virgo season. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, y'all Virgos, I love y'all energy. It's get shit done energy. It's practical energy. You know what I'm saying? It's, it, y'all rule by Mercury. So y'all like to think and communicate and, um, and analyze. And you know what I'm saying? Make sure make things sense in a routine. 
you know what I'm saying, as far as like what you're doing on a daily day basis. So y'all always going to be about y'all bag. Y'all always going to be about y'all, y'all, you know what I'm saying, y'all stability. Y'all, you know what I'm saying, and then y'all always going to make sure others are on their shit. And others sh should want to see y'all, I mean, copy y'all for that energy. You know what I'm saying? I always want, always, they should always, you should always, as a sun sign in Virgo, you should always want to have others, you know what I'm saying? You be the example for other, how others work out their situations or work out a, a certain, um, a certain algorithm in a way, or work out a certain, um, work out of their, um, get out, because it's, it's, it's an earth sign, so it's dealing with more practicality, so, hold on, let me see, oh, yeah, they <clears throat> so, um, it's an earth sign, so y'all deal with more practicality, so y'all should show people how to stabilize, be grounded, you know what I'm saying, um, not worry too much, because I know y'all can get into that energy worrying as well, you know what I'm saying, because it's ruled by, um, is ruled by Mercury, and Mercury likes to think a lot, so y'all can overthink sometimes, and that can bring stress on y'all and shit like that. It's like once y'all allow yourself to release from the pressures and the thoughts of um, of um, um, devil in the details and having the details of everything, then y'all be y'all. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can allow God to to be light, and God can use y'all as a vessel to uh, to uh, show us actually how to go about the the, the healthy energy and the, the the mental health energy and the and the stabilizing energy and the and the well roundedness energy and the mother because y'all you know what I'm saying y'all because y'all was by Leos too y'all like Leo season is right before y'all season so y'all like um so y'all like a little bit creativity you know what I'm saying because y'all right next to Leo so y'all like a little bit creativity. And that's where a Leo can learn from a Virgo. You know what I'm saying? A Leo can learn from a Virgo to be a little bit more serious and be a little bit more um, and, and be on your shit a little bit more. Make Take your shit to heart. You know what I'm saying, motherfucker? Like, you know, get out of here and work when you got to and shit like that. And then a Virgo can learn from a Leo to, um, to be a little bit less serious. You know what I'm saying? And to be a little bit more... Don't worry too much. Don't work about it too much and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? That'd be hard for a Virgo too. <laughs> so, and I know because Mario Virgo Moon, but um, but yeah. So uh, so Mario, you do that with your feelings. So you may do that with your um, you may do that with your feelings and shit like that. You may be like hella you mostly worry but you don't like to show that you like to show that and when you show that you get out your feelings so that's why i always tell you creativity is key and shit like that you know what i'm saying creativity is key in this bitch you know what i'm saying because it always it's always going to take you out of the body you know what i'm saying so whatever your created thing you know to be with god is to be at what absent from the body it said that in the bible so that's one thing that the, that the people that kaye talking about understand is that and, so anytime you have um, an idea, this separates you from the flesh. So it's like your fire, you know what I'm saying? So it it takes you out of, uh, that's the only way we can explain it here. It takes you out of body, you know what I'm saying? Anytime you create it, that's why a, per a person say, man, I just spent like two hours in a studio and I just felt like, man, like I wasn't even, you don't feel time or none of that. What you saying? You taking a lighter shape and form in a spiritual realm and then you like, doing some whole other shit with your mind type shit, you know what I'm saying? So it, it's it's just about, you know, what we're doing on the daily and just understanding that. The, the, the thing is, that's the thing, like, people with people and people with spiritual people, they talk about magic and shit like that. You'll come across videos of magic and shit like that, make it seem like that's some shit we all do, like, on a daily and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? That's some shit that they direct us to sleep a little bit like we're not doing. But it's just really just the, having an aspect and the understanding of that's what we're doing. So then once you in that way, you know what I'm saying, you get your you get into your power a little bit and things of that nature, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, but other than that, uh yeah, so you know, we uh right now the moon's in Leo, so we all kinda wanna, you know, we wanna react and respond to having fun, enjoying ourselves, expressing ourselves, paying attention to we want what we want to. So make sure you pay to attention to some shit that you like to pay attention to. You know what I'm saying? Some shit that may inspire you. Some shit that make you creative. Some shit that make you, you know what I'm saying? An uh, individual. Some shit that bring the character out of your ass too right now. You know what I'm saying? Or you're going to be paying attention to a bunch of shit. And that's that's why the Leo energy is so strong. Because, you know, they like to use others 
and shit and, and create a certain stage for themselves. So they don't care about good attention or bad attention. They don't care about it. But as long as it's what going to get them that feeling or whatever feeling they want to get off or whatever expression they want to get off, you know what I'm saying? That's what they're going to be in. They're going to be in that space where like they like to, um, you know what I'm saying? Um, they like to be seen and shit like that because they, they might have something to say and something like that. Or they might have a certain feeling to express or they might have a certain, you know what I'm saying? A certain uh, uh, thing that they want, you know what I'm saying? That's what kind of makes them, you know, the fixed fire sign because it's like they kind of be detached a little bit. You know what I'm saying? As far as like um, when it comes to like how other people might feel about what they're saying and shit like that. Because they be so self-centered on how they feel about it. And it may not be necessarily negative. But it may be, you know what I'm saying? It may, it's fire. You play with fire, you're going to get burnt. And shit like that. But we always need them to be like showing us how to do our um, individuality in some way, shape, or form. You know, uh, we always need them to show us how to be creative. And shit like that. Because sometimes you need to get cussed the fuck out. But if you can make that look creative and make it look like, oh, like... But it come together, though. You know what I'm saying? It make it, like, come together, then that's when you're doing the Leo energy the right way. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, it's, I'm trying to explain something. See, that's the thing about words. We be using words to explain where we at spiritually as well. You know what I'm saying? So that's the thing. Words are always limited. Remember that. You know what I'm saying? That's why all we, we always like, man, we want to say something. Or we always, that's why spiritually we always feel like we want to get to a certain point. Or we want to, what up, Lady Jaga? You know what I'm saying? We want to get to a certain point, but it'd be like, we be having to use words and shit like that. And the words is the only correlation right now as of how we communicate with each other to like kind of get our points across and shit like that. But we always trying to get to that center point point and that represent like where your, where your spirit be at a little bit. It'd be like, it'd be like in there, it'd be like in that soul spot, but you want to connect with there. So, you know, when you connect with there, all the fruits and juices and manifestations going to come there and shit like that. So it's almost like sex. We'd be having sex with the mind and shit too. You know what I'm saying, but um, but um, and sex is just a jo the the most purest form of sex is just to join in the two energies to make another. So before it even get to the physical of what we're doing and things, but um, yeah. So you know um, but yeah. So that's what Leo's here to show us. You know what I'm saying? Leo here to show us uh, how to um, how to be how to us be. To, I mean, to be thankful. You know what I'm saying? How we should be thankful about some shit. You know what I'm saying? What we should want to be seen for. Or what we want to express. Or what we want to be seen for. Anyone else feel like there's no language to communicate for what's going on? Yeah, I mean, that's what... Yeah, basically, shit. Basically, you know, that's what we're talking about um, now. You know what I'm saying? You know, but we only can utilize, you know, language, which is a form of sign and symbol, you know what I'm saying, to represent whatever we're trying to say spiritually. You know what I'm saying? And that's the best way. And the better you know how to do that, the better you can be more of an influence and, and create a certain position within your parameter because you're giving correlations to others uh, and, and, and they can in a way that they can understand and convey. So it's not like you just, you know what I'm saying? Anytime you got to make something realistic, you got to be a little bit more logical and shit like that. You make motherfuckers not think you you crazy and shit like that because that's how they do they'll try to just because you went to some whole other shit they'll try to teach you they'll try to treat you like you crazy or something like that you know what i'm saying they try to treat you like you crazy or you off the wall and shit like that you know what i'm saying but you be making more sense than them so it's like what are you into actually you know what i'm saying and then they gonna get into some either one of the jewish five pillars and shit like that um shadow government five pillars and basically use some other man knowledge to validate why they right and shit like that but i can be right too a bitch i got two eyes too i can go outside and see shit too you know what i'm saying <laughs> Fuck. Uh, you gotta always remember a person created a school you know what i'm saying <laughs> well a person like you a stinking ass person a person that go take showers every day hopefully you know what i'm saying they drink a little coffee you know what I'm saying? They think and see and get a feeling. And if that po idea become popular, then that's what become popular. But you always got to remember, a person created some shit. What up, Paris? What up, Miss Ash Blunt? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So don't ever get lost in that. You know what I'm saying? We all got the ability to be 
you know, individuals and, and see shit for ourselves and, and make sense of shit around us as well. So you always gotta keep that mentality within you, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, other anything that's that's really all I got to say and shit like that. Any y'all any y'all got opinions on, on Kanye or you know what I'm saying, Jewish people or what up, um what up, what up, what up, what up, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's all I got to say. You know what I'm saying? But I think uh <clears throat> for the most part, you know, yeah, well we can finish talking about that. So like the moon is in Leo right now. So you know what I'm saying, everybody, you know, uh, should we're going to be reacting, respond to something, um, things that are of Leo, like things that get a lot of attention, things that we entertain, you know what I'm saying, things that we want to want to see and feel, you know what I'm saying, and basically, um, and basically, it's, it's a fixed fire sign, so it like to be fixated on his own way of seeing and feeling. So everybody gonna be on in their own way of seeing and feeling right now and shit like that. So you might be rubbing and bumping shoulders with others and shit like that because we all react and responding to that energy now where the sun is at is in libra so how it's going to look is uh um uh, it's going to be based on how we want to see where libra is at our relationships and shit like that and shit like that and our relationships are vast so relationships go to not just with you and your relationship with your partner but it can go to you in the relationship you know what I'm saying? With your motherfucking character, with your idea, you know what I'm saying? With your motherfucking the people, places, and things. Always to always to your motherfucking thoughts and feelings. So everybody wants to have to uh, be in a position where right now they can relate their what? Sun and Leo, their moon, character, their feeling, and shit like that. So that's how you look at astrology. You look at astrology, it's like, it's, it's actually, um, you know, the sun just represents our action. The moon represents our feelings. Mercury represents thinking, communicating, all that shit. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I got videos on that. But yeah, you said he spoke facts. Yeah, he's, I feel like he spoke facts too. I think for the most part, what I think Kanye, I, I like about Kanye, I think he speaks for a certain space. And that space is just to, you know what I'm saying, um, eradicate uh, uh, um, unnecessary shit that we, don't, that we don't necessarily need because we have our um, own mind. So he like eradicating um, um, ways to think. You know what I'm saying? Or old ways of going about shit. Or old guards. You know what I'm saying? Old mentalities and shit like that. That we don't necessarily need to be in to specifically, you know, live our life and shit like that. And he's been doing that since college dropout. And that's what the college dropout was about. Because I did something that wasn't supposed to be done. Uh, so I was in a space, but I made it through. And I think for the most part, that's speaking to the spirituality of whatever he's calling God and shit like that because he made it through now the only thing about that is that the shit that he that that he accumulates um is like the money from you know um the people that created the system and shit like that that he so he got a bunch of relationships and ties which is nothing wrong with that because we all need we all need in on that in some way shape or form because we got to participate with the world and shit like that but that sometimes just how it's set up it kind of make you lose a certain sense of integrity with operating within that realm and that integrity be shit like you have to do certain things so they don't they don't let certain mentalities run free within that infrastructure so they be having like politics set up and shit like that where politics where you might you might have to cheer for joe biden they might call your manager and be like yo you gotta cheer for joe biden right now or you gotta make a video for the democrats or some shit like that and that's what he talking about you know what i'm saying he talking about that shit like he don't really want to par have to participate in that shit you know what i'm saying he want to play his own position you know what i'm saying and because a lot of that shit leads the people like the people that are unaware like the people in the hood and shit like that where we live at it leads us to doing shit that ain't necessarily creative or individual to our own context. But this is how the government sit back and look at y'all like y'all. This is how the government sit back and look at y'all like, well, y'all need this crutch because y'all haven't came up with y'all own mentality and way of going about God without us giving y'all y'all shit and make and make us want to come to y'all. You get what I'm saying? So it's like deep. Uh, he said, we got to play the cards we were dealt for now, for sure. You know what I'm saying? What up, DJ Mew? Me, you? Yeah, we're going to be out motherfucking 
Motherfucker, when you, uh, we're going to be out um, over there real soon, over there in the eastern continents. We're going to be over there real soon. Do a Cito's Clubhouse. I think when you was in Tokyo or something like that, hell yeah. What up, Rose Gold Wings? But yeah, so that's that's what um, keep flying for, a specific space. Now, I don't know how spiritually inclined he is to know that, like, this shit, you know, because you got to play the game real, real, real smooth. You know what I'm saying? You got to play the game real smooth. Real smooth. You know what I'm saying? You got to be like a Jedi master and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? That's how you do it and shit like that. But, you know, when you playing in that game and shit like that. But uh, we play this game every day on our own level, though, because, you know, this is what run the world and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? As far as you having to get up and get your ass and get your ass a job and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Get your ass, you know, until you, you, you be able to come up or, or with your own creative and thing. And now we have the tools to do it. So we got IG. We got motherfucking cameras. We got people with, with personalities. We got community. We got a way to talk. You know what I'm saying? I'm bringing that way to talk in and things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? A way to communicate astrology and get on our own accord and become more famous than everybody in the celebrity sphere because that shit trash right now. You know what I'm saying? So we the new celebrities. You know what I'm saying? So you, you got to see it like that. It ain't no, it does. And I've been one for a long time in my own realm. In my own realm. You know? But, uh, yeah, so that's what I think about this shit. It's community for me. Hell yeah. Real shit, real shit. And that's what we're we gonna ride. We're gonna keep rocking with it in that way. Um, but yeah, bro. Yeah, Kanye, I, think, I like what he's doing. You know what I'm saying? He need to put me on Keep My Spirit Alive remix, though. You know what I'm saying? Cito got the best raps out. Real shit. Um, but yeah, I'm about to motherfucking hop into my day. I'm going to upload this on um, YouTube and shit like that. Um, I'll have some more um, music coming soon and more astrology shit y'all can get into. If you haven't joined the clubhouse, we uh, we love it over there. Make sure everybody, you know what I'm saying, um, real Mari can attest to, you know what I'm saying, we building daily. We build it, I mean, we build it monthly. Really real shit. Like, real shit. Like, we build it monthly. And we motherfucking making sure motherfucking minds is, is we got the community going. That's what the community at right now. You know what I'm saying? That's what the community at. So, yeah, everybody make sure y'all have a good day. You know what I'm saying? Get into y'all creativity. Creativity. There's a clubhouse link in the bio. It's cthoworld.com slash mem uh, membership and shit like that. So that's the clubhouse. You know what I'm saying? It's a strategy community. You know what I'm saying? Where we, uh, where we um, chop up and shit like that. You get a uh, call with me every month. You know what I'm saying? We just build on your astrology. We build a relationship, and we do this shit in real time. Um, we also have group um, um, events and shit like that where people are presenting their own um, their own interpretations and shit like that. We call it Clubhouse Expressions. We also have uh, Clubhouse Meditation every Saturday. Um, and we have what the fuck it, uh, a Clubhouse um, um, Telegram and shit like that. So we just talk shit. Talk good strategy shit. Talk good, you know what I'm saying, shit. And we gonna, and we do events. So I just did my first event in Chicago. No, my second event in Chicago. My first one was in Atlanta. And that shit was lit. And we're going to come all the way, all around the world with it. And things of that nature. How these bitches set up in every city, state. Include the greatest association known to man. You know what I'm saying? Um... You know, and shit, change culture. Like I said, we already doing that shit. So, you know, um, that's what the fuck we going to do. Um, I hope y'all have a great day. And I love y'all for real. Real shout out. Yeah.